If you've ever wondered if you need to know mathematics to become a game developer, then you're in the right place. In this video, we're going to dive deep into the role math plays in game development and why it's essential in creating your favorite games. We'll break down how math is used in different aspects of game development, from graphics to physics to AI. And stay tuned until the end because we'll reveal a surprising mathematical trick used in one of the most popular games out there. Before we dive in, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more insights into the world of game development and beyond. Let's start with graphics. Mathematics is fundamental in creating the visual elements of a game. Geometry helps creating the game characters and the environment, while linear algebra is essential for transformations like scaling, rotating and translating the objects in the game world. Without math, creating those stunning 3D visuals would be impossible. Next up, physics. Math allows developers to simulate realistic movements and interactions. Calculus and trigonometry, for example, are used to calculate trajectories, collisions and other physical behaviors. This makes the game world feel authentic and immersive, from the way a character jumps to how objects fall and break. I would love to hear your thoughts on this topic. Have you ever thought about the math behind your favorite game? Drop a comment below or get in touch with me on social media. Your feedback helps shape our future content. And remember to stick around until the end for that surprising mathematical trick used in a top game. At number 3, we have artificial intelligence. AI in games, and in general actually, heavily relies on math too. Algorithms, statistics and probability are used to create NPCs' behaviors that are both challenging and realistic. This ensures that characters can make decisions, learn and adapt, providing a more engaging experience for the player. At number 4 we have procedural generation. This is another fascinating area. This technique uses algorithms and mathematical rules to create large amounts of content quickly and efficiently. For example, games like Minecraft use procedural generation to create infinite, unique worlds for players to explore. This would not be possible without the power of math. Next one is game balancing. Balancing a game that's challenging but fair also involves a lot of math. Developers use statistical analysis and probability to fine-tune the game mechanics, ensuring that no single strategy or element dominates. This actually keeps the gameplay interesting and competitive. So do you really have to know mathematics to become a game developer? The short answer is yes, actually. But don't be intimidated. While you don't need to be a math genius, a solid understanding of basic math principles is essential. Math is used in various aspects of game development, from writing algorithms rhythms to creating graphics and simulating physics. However, many game engines and development tools are actually designed to make these tasks more accessible. So while math is important, there are plenty of resources to help you learn and apply it effectively in your projects. As promised, here's that surprising mathematical trick. Did you know that the developers of Tetris used a randomization algorithm to ensure a fair distribution of pieces? They used a bag system where each piece type is drawn exactly once before the bag is field. This simple yet brilliant use of math ensures that the game remains fair and fun. So let me explain. In classic Tetris, there are seven different tetrominoes, also known as pieces, each with a unique shape. If the pieces were chosen entirely random, you might end up with long runs of the same piece, making the game frustrating and less enjoyable. The bag system works by placing one of each of the seven pieces into a virtual bag. The game then draws from this bag without replacement, meaning each piece is only drawn once until the bag is empty and refilled with another set of 7 pieces. This method prevents tricks of the same piece and ensures a balanced distribution, making the game smoother and more enjoyable. This clever use of a mathematical concept keeps players engaged and coming back for more. Thanks for watching! If you enjoyed this video, check out our other content on game development. Don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next video!